substantive speaker is in the chair. But meanwhile, uh, before we proceed, what's your member for Kitutu Masaba? What is your point of order? No, no, please sit down. There's someone else on their feet. Uh, thank you, Madam Speaker. Uh, with, all, with all respect to our majority leader, uh, Madam Speaker, I was worried whether their honorable majority leader is in order to know, knowing very well that our constituents are watching this television. Is it in order for him to name individuals, name by name, reading a list, whereas some of the members whom he has named were here during the morning session all the way to the end, and they are, and they are out here coming, so they have not missed their attendance. These, some of these naming can be very damaging. Yes, it is a public document whereby they were informed because if you look at the order paper, there is no CS there. So no one is under obligation to be here to create quorum. If you have a problem to deal with your chairs, you deal with the chairs. If you want to tell us to impeach them, let us impeach. But you cannot go naming us on live TV for not attending. We are elected to be here and we are answerable to our people, but the majority leader is not the Member prefect to read the names. Thank you, Honorable. I don't think any of those uh, chairpersons have given you a brief to hold their brief and to be able to be their advocates. So I think they will speak for themselves. Uh, Honorable Member for Kitu Masaba, please be seated. Yes, you do not hold a brief for them. They shall respond on their own behalf. The Honorable Sarah.